Today we wanted to talk a little bit about reinforcement learning and why it's important. Andy, what exactly is reinforcement learning? Yeah, reinforcement learning is one of the many post-training techniques that people use to make their LLMs more intelligent. Uh, it's really important because not only does it teach what your model should be doing, it also teaches your model what it shouldn't be doing. So unlike the traditional method of supervised fine-tuning, where you will give the model input and then tell it the expected output, reinforcement learning uses a reward mechanism to tell the model, hey, you did this well, and you, or you didn't do this well, but it wouldn't directly tell you why. So the model is then forced to generalize its weights to learn how do you maximize a given reward. So does reinforcement learning actually then change the model weights? Yeah, definitely. Reinforcement learning, just like supervised fine tuning, are all part of the post-training uh, techniques that people use to make models like ChatGPT. Um, it's really important, especially when you want to do stuff like model alignment and then improving its reasoning. The recent DeepSeek uh, model, for example, used reinforcement learning as its main post-training technique to get the reasoning capabilities. How do people who are maybe building AI agents, how should they be thinking about this reinforcement learning process and what should they be doing to try to actually get some of these improvements as they're building out agents? Instead of just naively taking a good input and output, and trying to fine tune your model off of it, you should define a reward rubric. So meaning that what is something that you can verify using code to figure out the quality of an agent, right? So if it's something like tool calling, your reward rubric can be simple as, did it follow the structure of the tool? And was the parameters supplied actually correct, right? So by doing this, you're teaching the model to how to use tools and how to supply parameters rather than just using supervised fine tuning and telling the user or telling the model what alpha to make. It's kind of like teaching you how to fish rather than just giving you the fish. Cool. Thanks. Yep.